Hey man, what to do you two? It's your boy back again with another man in video, man. This is the second video for the day. Oh, shout out to OG Almighty for this video, man. Let's get straight into it, man. So oh but I'm like, I can't hear myself. I forgot I turn I turned the uh, game down. Loudest on God. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, OG Almighty player build tips for 2K25. That's all you need to know, man. So make sure y'all subscribe, like, share. Go to OG Almighty Channel. He got a lot of videos. Matter of fact, is they gonna give me an ad if I show y'all? If, if I come back and show y'all, but so if y'all want to, y'all want to test. He he been dropping them, man. You know what I'm saying? He been dropping them back to back to back to back to back. You know what I'm saying? The back to back. You know what I'm saying? Like the back to back. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, man. Y'all want to go? Shout out them. Let's get into it. Yeah, giving free promo. He he more than me. Beef with this nigga all city dog. Sorry, nah. Drop that like, subscribe. Today's video, I'm going to be talking to you guys about the builder. We're going to go over a leaked build that has gotten leaked on NBA 2K25. And I want to make it very clear to you guys before you go in, because I, I had a realization of something with the legend badges and just some key things, you know, how they're trying to balance us this year just so we have more uniqueness. I've been preaching that in the 2K a lot that there needs to be more uniqueness, not with, not, and we used to have it in older 2Ks because when it comes down to placing your attribute points, you can copy somebody and make a build or you can make your own and people will be like, oh, damn, he made it that way. You'll have somebody copy you, but there's going to be infinite ways of doing that. And that's what I feel like is going to create that uniqueness to, and the differences, whether between this build can get this over your build because this build has this and boom. And then the arm sleeve, they add more now to us. Remember, do not forget the arm sleeve that 2K has added, the accessories that add more to your player's build as hey, well. Bro, so why you, why, why, I got beef with you now. Why are you telling my, my secret? I had a 90, I had a 90 main range. <laughs> I had a 90 mid range with my 6'8. You know what I'm saying? Why are you telling them that? Don't tell them nothing like that. Don't tell them nothing like that, man. You know what I'm saying? have to remember that's in there as well when looking at the builds because some people first glance when i make you realize this you probably look at it like damn yo we got hit bad but it's like remember they have all this other stuff added in so it's like a journey for us you know we're playing the game and there's something to do throughout the whole cycle right let's get into this part now is video of all city let's watch this and talk about this because i had some people i guess who are new subscribers and that's why i don't take y'all serious you know i guess he's unsubscribed for me because all city's going hard at me and and dogging me out or whatever the case he thinks like that's why i say you this internet stuff man the internet i learned man it poisoned y'all brains like ah that's why i got that's why i gotta click with i don't know they, the internet poisons y'all brains a lot. question how do y'all feel about creators begging to go to community day? and i'm talking about like no dignity whatsoever like literally getting on your knees and begging 2k to send that invite out like do y'all even see that as a real thing do you think there's a creator out there who would get on his knees and beg 2k i hate to do it but it's a real reality y'all it's like damn <laughs> i listen i'm getting on my knees Next year, 2K community, I'm getting on my knees. I actually, like, listen. Y'all see this video right now? Look. Ronnie, 2K to all the devs. Look, I'm on my knees. I'm actually on my two knees on this hard floor right now. Listen. Get deeper than that. Just send that invite. They had the nice little uh, hardwood. Hard, hardwood, yeah. They gotta bring OG out. Wow, no shame. I guess to each their own, man. Some folks do whatever's necessary to get where they want to go. One thing I do know is getting on your knees, that'll help put you ahead of the pack. That's exactly the position that 2K wants you to be in. Now let's get into this drama between Luck TV and Power DF. I'm going to reference quite a few posts, and the first one is from Luck TV saying, Now look, right after my post, like, now people could take that as, oh, he's flaming up most of me, but anybody. Uh, he knows I'm the type of creator. I'm the um, what do you call me? I'm the uh, like I joke a lot. Like some a lot of things I say, people take serious, and some things I say, I'm not even being serious. Like something like that, which is me totally acting. But I think that's the problem with you know what I'm saying. Some y'all need. I be taking everything to the heart. You know what I'm saying? 
Like when I, I reacted to that exact same video. I don't, what, what video was that? Where my phone at? Phone somewhere in the motherfucker. But I reacted to that exact same video. I knew he was playing. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not saying all oh, oh, he was taking that shit to heart. No, he, taking that shit serious. He wasn't taking that shit serious. He was just making it, you know what I'm saying? Some people actually, there's some real people that actually do that. You feel me? They, they, Please, 2K. Like, come on, dog. We ain't that serious, bro. Like, yeah, some of y'all people in real life, y'all niggas me, young. Yeah, I'm not offended about that. You're talking about me. I ain't offended about nothing. You can call me every name in the book. I don't care. I'm God, I don't care. I don't get two fucks. You feel me? Like, you gotta, like, the internet made y'all soft low key you know what i'm saying can we go back to the days when people was doing cocaine in the bathroom right next to the kids you know what i'm saying if you, a person don't know me or they're not familiar with me i guess it's gonna come off like that's what i'm really on i feel like the way i speak 2k is not going to invite me world he's talking to the guy because he messed he commented on my video first and was talking about um how your kid is gonna see whatever the case is like bro do you understand when you get up when you be, if you try to get yourself in a content creator status field or get yourself more known with the status that's what comes with it there's many creators that people put fake stuff about them they put ai stuff they crop their pictures out and do this bro i had somebody literally i've had it before i've had somebody literally crop my face out of my picture put his face on next to my girlfriend while she was prego Come on, bro. I've been in this field, bro. Stuff don't bother me. I don't take stuff personal when it comes to this. Are y'all serious? I be like, damn. All right. Finally, somebody at least showed a highlight, made it known. Okay, they watch my videos because they was able to take a clip from my videos. Most people try to keep me under the rug and like I'm I'm still supposedly underrated type time. You see what I'm saying? I comment on All City's video. He liked it. I'm looking at it like he's doing like battle rap wordplay basically. He's talking about getting on your knees, not having no, sh having some shame. And in reality, if he does watch my content, most of the time you see how I talk about 2K, how I speak on the stuff that they don't do, how I talk deep, deep. So in reality, this is the real highlight of him saying, sorry, saying all this stuff about Ronnie and stuff and then taking it back wanting to go to community day just so it, it can, he could get benefit because that's what community day is it's benefiting you so you can get the early content get around the creators and you feel like your life is moving up and going up me personally og i don't care about that shit bro there's niggas that's like i'm bro logically i'm smart enough to understand there's niggas that's make like all city himself is making enough money where it's like bro it's like and pulling enough views and traction is like when the game drop bro you can just it's not a race you can just drop your shit but to certain creators like uh, luck it's when he's seen all the creators there and they getting to touch the new 2k and it's like he was there well i don't know if he was there before one time i think maybe i don't know i'm I don't thirsty know, I, don't know I don't think he went but when you just see the creators go and you see them getting the, the benefits the jerseys and stuff they're posting on twitter they're getting on no, i'm thirsty as hell no, no. that hits certain people and they get jealous i tell people even in my real life people like don't fall into that social media shit where you getting upset when you have your own reality when you wake up out the bed you're looking you're in your own world if this shit didn't exist you would be stuck in your own world and some of y'all would literally put yourselves in mental hell thinking hell is like a yeah hell is on earth you would put yourself in a mental hell now i gotta put a little bit of gems out because y'all just don't get reality sometimes y'all take things too far try to over dramatize things mm. it's like come on try to not be on this internet and just deal with yourself right right that's why people are on the internet you're judging too much you're thinking this you're thinking too hard in other people's situations like he was like, like oh my god my still recording he stays out of content is the camera still working so that's all right cool we cool my fault, my fault. and either like so even if so let's say if he was serious i'm not upset about that that's promo to me if that was the case all right but he's always shown love and respect in other videos bro this that's just me being funny bro i'm getting on my knees for real i don't even think that works if i kiss ass kiss ass kiss ass kiss ass i feel like that's draining that's draining i just want to be myself and they pick you out the, the bunch that's it that's draining to be kissing ass and never knowing when it's going to come type shit like the hell nah y'all crazy to be able to see that side Sometimes it don't play out. It don't work like that, you know? But him, he was doing this. He apologized. Where he went wrong was he deleted his tweet. You don't do that. Just keep it up. Take what comes with it. Take what people saying about you. Like, oh, like, oh, I ain't even see this, bro. I was so dozed out, bro. 
Not because he talking. I was just nosed out. I was listening, but I, I mean, yeah, yeah. Two K is a scam. They claim VC's fixed, and I'm like, oh, the VC ain't real. Why do VC's charges on my bank? That's because you paying for it, you idiot. Um, you know, for you know, saying for people to keep shutting down your bond with two K. You guys is actually fake and weird scammers. Really not scamming if you know what you're getting into, but you know, very dumb out here. You know what I'm saying? Uh, VC is not planted property. Instead, VC is fiction created by game publishers. That's the same way, you know, the Madden Bucks, uh, beat Fort, Fortnite V Bucks, um, the MT they added. It's some other, other games that has, you know, currency like that. You know, like I said, Madden. Uh, probably, probably e even um even the crew too probably got some uh currency that you can buy. Uh, what else? Um, what what game got currency, guys? Oh, the other I can really search this up. Oh, Minecraft got currency. Let's look. Call of Duty, uh, GTA, college football was that same with man. That same with man. Let's go. Let's go. I got my PlayStation right here. Uh, we got Valorant, First Descendant, Apex, uh, First Descendant, uh, I already said, man, and, you know, every game got a currency, guys, let's, you know, every online game that you can physically buy some got currency, so we don't, I don't know, I don't know what you talking about. posted a clip of me, take what people was gonna come when you, when you put something out. I already know how people can view that old oh, people can view it. we in that era where everything looked like it's sus now everything looking sus and stuff like so i get it come on now i that was a comedy joke because this is what people say everybody to get to community day they have to be on their knees they have to be that's not true they want influence i've been giving this gem out for years 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 but since i'm one of those people who speak out a certain way i don't know if Is I he on that shit right now i don't know but Influence is the number one key thing. They okay? go for them. Then they take their, they take a few creators who they see who they want to say, okay, maybe we can put you in here to give you a job. Maybe if they was posting right or they ain't going like, EJ is there. EJ be saying F Mike Wayne on his stream. I can get a clip. F you Mike Wayne. Wait, come on. He said, oh, 2K got to do better next year. Like each, he, like he literally was in those vibes talking like that. Okay. It's been other creators that's like crazy. Cheeseaholic. Cheeseaholic talks crazy to people. F your mother and stuff da, 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 on his streams. And they have him there. So it's obviously it's influence in a certain you don't speak on nobody and you stay in your lane because it's not a control thing. They just want to see if you have that character to, where you're not speaking on nobody. You're not really speaking on too much things where you're getting in drama. For example, look at Poor Boy Sin. Poor Boy Sin went to community day before. But why is Poor Boy Sin not there? Because he's always in drama with people on Twitter. He's always posting like too much of his of his real self rather than his character. Then you see other people do. Most other people, you just see their character and they're doing their character. That's what 2K wants from people. They just want your character to being there. And then you knowing how to handle all the legal rules and stuff and, and be, hey, don't post no leak, don't do nothing like that. And they want to use your character that's there to bring more traction to the game. Enjoy right. the community today. Ronnie 2K, I watched EJ's video. Ronnie 2K said the people he felt was there was top 100. So in 2K's mind, that's their top 100. They probably have a whole analysis how they pick people and go, because they're not just picking random, random anybody's. They even if they pick a person that is a low creator, they still have some type of personality character that yep. 2K likes that they was watching, analyzing. I feel like they go that deep on it. Some people may not think, but I do. It's their company. You're not just gonna bring any and everybody, all right? We off of this now. Like, so that's just me making a joke off of it. Come on now. <laughs> he just used the clip. Like, who cares? All right, now let's get into this. We now have the badge. I want y'all to see something about this. Nine, the legend badges. Remember. That mean my six eight should be able to get it easy. <laughs> please, nigga, please. Bro, let me, I'm trying to be a point forward this year. Just let me get that. Let me get that shit, man. This, y'all. There's going to be a pair like a legend build because there's going to be somebody who's strictly going to go for those high levels and they're going to be more role players. I've been seeing a lot of YouTube and content creators talk about, yo, you're going to need more of your teammates and more assists for certain things. And it's going to be true. Boy, we're in the wreck going to be hell for some people, boy. I ain't going to lie. True. It's not going to be true in the sense where it's like, yo, you're really, you're not going to be able to do nothing. But it's going back to that older 2K where you're going to feel more of just stronger in your role if you have your build set a certain way. You see how the jumps are way higher this year. 
I know many of people feel like, oh, I'm not even gonna be really going for ankle assassin. But you have to understand, the ratings are the same. It's gonna be the same for other categories. Don't think, oh, it's gonna be lowered. It's gonna be the same for other categories. And then remember, they have that max badge perk. So legend badges are definitely going to be more rare if a person says, I wanna go with a balanced build and just go to that Hall of Fame cap. See, they're keeping, they're make, they're gonna make us have different players. And then even when you have Hall of Fame, remember if you cap your player out and you just say, okay, I'm gonna strictly go for like a Hall of Fame, you're still in the 90s. So it's like, they're still, they're still like not tricking us, but they're still leading us to this direction. You see what I'm saying? Going towards that legend because everybody's gonna be using that max badge perk and making a certain badge go to legend for sure. And then sometimes people may not, depending on how their build is, what may work for them. I, I see a lot of strategy coming here. Because remember, we're still gonna be out there with pieces. It's gonna be like a puzzle piece still where there's going to be a lot. There may be a PG who can't play D, but he there will be a lockdown who will more so probably do more of that for him. Or people coming out with two lockdowns. I can see those lineups coming back because those are the type of just lineups when you are limited to certain things like a guard that don't have that high. I'm gonna be playing the three again. Lockdown that could come in place you see me at small forward, don't, don't say that. So, they're putting putting us back in that bucket now, really. I like that though. So nineteen. Here and I show you guys this. Build. Nineteen. My six eight better be just like nineteen. Build. Yo, people were saying like, yo, it was crazy because I was looking at the regular two K screen and counting the boxes. They using the same builder format, so that's on them. That's their fault that I can do that. You know what I mean? They if they didn't use the same builder format and kind of had it different or maybe something like you know, but that's on them. When we looking at this stretch build, people, it is very, very hit. The stretch has strength. He went for certain things like strength, so at least he can box out and maybe get a board. But we see his rebound stats are very, very low. We we can see that his rebound stats are very. Bro, I ain't gonna lie, bro. If I'm a straight fuck the rebound, nigga, y'all just gonna have to get that shit your damn self, bro. If I if I can get it with my vert, okay, cool. I'm not going for no damn strength. <laughs> Not so high strength, it looks low like strength, yeah. Close up into the 90s already. Maybe he has a little bit more to put for his rebounding. But this uh, like I think he 98. Build, the agility probably wanted to move around. Oh, I'm being the type of stretch to move around and, you know, do everything, right? It has a little bit of ball handle. has a little bit of speed with ball. The defense sat there was suffering, but we see the block is there. Well, our subs helped me realize, yeah, this was a stretch more because I just looked at the key stats. The block is high. The block is high. Is high. Yeah, it's still my fault. The block is high, too. But that still is high and then, still is high this like the shot is high six, eight six nine stretches and they try to just go freaky on it but this to me seems like a bad build you never yeah. say a build is bad especially with because like look at this bro we already already said this one we was going over it but he got a standing dunk bro i ain't gonna lie if you like six eight you like six eight Six nine. If you a tall build, I ain't gonna lie, you automatically get standing ducks, bro. I ain't, I ain't gonna keep it. I'm gonna keep it being with you. If she can be a twenty five, you're gonna get it. I think my I think mine was a thirty five this year, and I was getting them. So like, it really, really, you got too much on your plate. Like you trying to be a layup guy. You trying to be a you trying to be a standing dunk dunk guy. You know what I'm saying? You trying to be a driving dunk. You trying to do everything, and that's the issue. Uh, what, that's that's what I like about this builder. You can't do everything. You gotta, you know what I'm saying? You gotta stick somewhere. You gotta, you gotta stick somewhere because like he got like look. There's not there's not one. I'll say, I don't know if that's his defensive rebound at zero. I'm gonna say it's at zero. But there's only one stat he don't have nothing in. Every other stat have something in there. And I think that mid range is eating it up. But I think his finishing eating all that shit up. Eating all that shit up. Like he don't he got. I say he got a, like around 70. He got around a 70, 75 pass at or like 65, something like that. Ball handling, maxed out. Speed ball, maxed out. Damn near all his physical stats, maxed out. Like, you know what I'm saying? Everything. He's he's eating up stats. So, like me, I don't reach like that. I don't reach like that. So, I would bring all that still down just to get some more in some, another area. So, like. New building, I know the full. I think the build abilities up. of it, but. I think like, it is. He has the standing dunk there and then the driving layup. So one thing that I'm starting to realize too is that also it's tricky because I've seen YouTubers saying the builder is tricky too. Again, they're all back on that. They tried it. Demi deleted his tweet too when he said that the trunker nerf. He deleted that tweet. I've seen it. But he's, he confirmed that it was a nerf. 
it seems like certain stats go up as well when you put certain things up. Yeah. So his standing dunk is high and his driving layups high. Most people be like, why would they do that over the driving dunk? Why not just take away? But it's probably like 2K is probably capping you out there. You know, I know the new stuff like that is there in the game. Then you see his shooting is high. Both shooting areas is maxed out. So this is how we knew this is some type of stretch build. And it was giving me KD vibes, y'all. Like maybe like a 6'9-ish. Like, 6'9", 16 is. We don't know what six know. eight. Because like, like, he stacked out all hair, you can see the physicals is really stacked out, especially on the agility and the speed and the strength. Everything is stacked out on the physicals. So it's like this person really wants to. Something makes me realize, like, yo, these physicals are probably really important. Just agility, like, think about it. If you don't have your agility up, you're gonna be moving slow. Slow as hell on defense. And since that's a new feature in the game that may feel real nasty if you don't have a good agility it may take some getting used to and you just may not feel as swift as you really want to and it may just throw you off when it comes to your off ball shooting or moving around off ball to shoot so i just see it going crazy this year especially with a small pg like some some like they decks with it oh my god no 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 I could see it like a little 6'3, they max out the agility crazy or 6'2, whatever. And then they just use the center set screens and then they just dex behind off ball, faster agility. So if you don't have your lock guarding it over there, oh my lord, I'm seeing a meta form already in our face. I'm trying to get to the meta stuff first, y'all. I'm trying to get that out the way because I feel like once you can see that, you can kind of make a build better. And agility is new. I think trying to rework the shooting badges. I'm gonna say this. I think slashing, depending on how it is, it, it, it can go one way, and it depends on the interior defense. The slashing either gonna be meta or it's gonna be average. I'm gonna say that it's gonna be meta or it's gonna be average. If that interior defense good, and you know how to work it, it's gonna separate you from the bunch. It's gonna separate you from the bunch. So if you know how to work around getting in that paint, if you're a true slasher, I'll call them true slashers because you know how to, you can, uh, oh, somebody right there, uh, uh, lay. You know what I'm saying? If you know how to do that, it's going to separate you from the bunch. Not the interior defense, boo-boo. Everybody dunking on everybody. Then, then we got an issue. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, either slashing going to be hella good, average. Then it's going to be if you know how to work around, separate yourself from the bunch. A bit. So shooting, we're going to be a little bit more balanced there when we're trying to put our build up because we're going to feel it when we when we like try to put other stats. I can see it already. This build is too like, for me, if I'm looking at it naturally, I'm making my build. This doesn't look like a lot to me. It's like, damn, it, it's like a hit, like where I got to pick and choose. I can tell when I get on the builder, I'm going to be picking and choosing and then my attribute caps and then the sleeves. I'm going to also be factoring that in my mind as well. Okay. And then the new takeover. The sleeves, somehow, the sleeves give me, give me animations too. So another, and then they're going to let, allow you to test. I'm telling you, people going to be in the builder for so long, like being able to just test your jump shot, your sig. Bro, I'm making my first build. I'm go All right, I told y'all this. I'm making my first build going to sleep, waking up before, before I, Start grinding my build. I'm going to be in that build. No cap. And they're going to have people confused in that way. That's the new way. That's the new way. Give everybody everything right there up front. You know when you actually really play and badges are starting to go against each other. Stuff. It's going to be so much different. Like, damn, oh, I got to switch this. Oh, I got to. Oh, man. That's all it is about 2K. Every year, I feel like we're going to have to deal with that. If they change the game up and give us some type of like new type of game, and it feels new, feels different, change up stuff, take away stuff. Yeah. I just want to make my 6 8. So, Pove. Man, Pove. another cycle about to start up again. Appreciate everybody for showing love, dropping likes on the videos, man. I'll do some more funny skits for y'all, too. So, and some money, some more funny things in this stuff, you know, for the videos for y'all. Please don't take everything I do serious. Don't take everything I say serious. Like, I'm not getting on my knees for 2K, whatever that means. Oh, uh, yeah, bro. But, you know what I'm saying? We out of here, man. Let me know what y'all think. I already got my point four build in, in mind. So, hopefully, y'all can. When it comes to the game, I can actually make that build. You feel me? But hopefully most of the stats is most of the cap attributes is the same. So like contact, I'm mostly looking at that contact dunk. Cause that's how, that's how now I can spread out my, my, you know what I'm saying? So if I got to have like an 86 vert, that's going to knock some of us down. You feel me? If I can still have that 82, we going to be Gucci.
But yeah, man, we was looking at them caps. So if it's still 90, 94 for elite contact dunks, I'm going with there. But I also know the legend badge plus five cap. And then now he's saying, he's saying the uh, the sleeves help too. I mean, the sleeves always been helping, but they help more. They help let you get badges and stuff. Okay, cool. We gonna, we gonna rock with that. You know what I'm saying? But let me know what y'all think. I'm up out of here. Peace, man. Yeah.